Hello everybody, I'm Storm here. Welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4, Millennium Dawn, Greece. In the last episode, uh, we went ahead and declared our war on Malaysia, and since they were uh, guaranteed by Pakistan, uh, we had to fight them as well. So we sent our troops in, and we made rather quick work of Pakistan. So they are now puppeted. I felt that that was probably the best option to go ahead and just make them a puppet for for now. I'm not even sure I'll ever actually absorb them. I'll uh, think about it. We're continuing to work on trying to puppet Iran and San Marino. And uh, keep working on that project. And we're getting ready to launch naval invasions of Malaysia. We'll see how that goes. Now, I keep getting comments about my debt. And yes, I know I have a ton of debt. In fact, I can go ahead and pay a little bit of that off. Um, the reason why I have that debt is, again, because I am absorbing my puppets. Because I am annexing my puppets. Every time you annex a puppet... You take on all of their debt, right? And Azerbaijan had like $10 trillion in debt. And so when I took them on, I took on all that debt. And Padania had like a couple of trillion dollars in debt. So when I absorbed them, I took on all of that debt. And so I don't really have a choice in that matter. When I absorb a puppet, I absorb all of their debt. Just. It is what it is. Uh, Slovenia is going to be next on the docket. They only have two hundred billion in debt. Uh, who else is my puppets? Um, Vatican City, uh, Botswana, South Africa, and Syria. Let's see, how much debt does Syria have? Syria has 1.4 trillion in debt. Uh, Botswana has 100 billion in debt, and South Africa has 3.7 trillion in debt. So I'm gonna have to still eat all of that. Pakistan has 250 billion in debt. So yeah, every time I absorb one of those, I take it on. Oh, yeah, and the other thing that happened in last episode is the United States declared war on Israel, of all things. And um, so I went ahead and kicked them out of the faction. Now, I was initially thinking, like, as it was happening, was that, well, I could just let the United States attack them and, you know, just not join the war because I don't have to. Uh, but then I realized that what was going to happen is that Israel was going to go ahead and call to arms everyone else in my faction. And then all of them would be fighting, like France and Romania and Hungary and so forth and so on. And since I didn't want to have my entire faction destroyed, I went ahead and just kicked them out and let them uh, deal with that on their own. So, that's kind of where we're at. Alright, what is the time on my... Okay, so we got another 15, 17 days. And yeah, you want to join in. No, everybody else wants to join the war. We're going to say no. You know what we could really use over here is we could use a spy network in Malaysia to improve our intelligence. We know what their ships are doing. We know precisely what their ships are doing. Back, we have a battle. Well, no, that's uh, 
Yeah, that's some Corvettes and some Frigates. That are engaging some of my attack submarines. Or my attack submarines were engaging them and it appears that they uh, retreated. France has some attack submarines out there. Some... I see some ballistic missile subs. Okay. Speaking of ballistic missiles... Uh, 60 days yet till we actually have any ICBMs. Okay. 20 days until we have some more launch vehicles and some more commsats. All right, naval invasion is ready to go. We can lower our subjects' autonomy. Uh, Vatican City, yep, yeah, go ahead and do it. Um, can we spread our influence? Not quite yet. These little city states are so hard to click on. Let's go. Insufficient naval supremacy in regions. Persian Gulf. Really? Oh, that's because they're still in exercises. <laughs> uh, get out there. Oh, right. Actually, the whole fleet needs to be assigned uh, jobs because... And they're undergoing repairs. Um... Modern satellite internet access. Go for it. And um, I'm going to tell you yes, to cancel. Cancel your repairs for now. We'll send you back to port for repairs later. I need you in operation. There we go. In fact, that's all we really needed. Uh, go ahead and head back for repairs. It won't take them long to get fixed up. It won't take them long. Let's see. We have ten factories that can be used. Um... Looks like we have an old... An old submarine. It looks like it got banged up a little bit. Yeah, we still have some old attack subs kicking around. It's alright. Any attack submarines that get sunk, we'll replace them with new ones. Uh, 
últimos. Let's hope this works. I don't know what's going on over here. Is this my invasion attempt? not look like it's going so well. Yep. They are probably gone. Alright, that did not work. Might as well go ahead and get the replacements in training now. Needed that invasion that to succeed. Oh, we need air support or something. I don't know what we're going to do down there. There's no air support. Let's go ahead and annex Slovenia. Just to take care of that. See, if we could break this attack. And then try to break out. Oh my 
goodness. Look at... Look at their attack and defense stats. Yeah, they're gone. All right. Factor access to Malaysia has been achieved. That is going to be a tough nut to crack. Hmm. <laughs> There's our 2025 MBTs. Alright, so not 2035 yet, so that's as good as we're going to get for now. Let's get our APC 2015s. I'll need to come up with a name for these MBTs at some point. Just a sec. Okay. I have an idea for that. Let's just create a variant. And actually, I could up armor, up, you know, improve the reliability, improve its engine, up gun it. Yep. And then we're going to call this. And there's not going to be any other further variants of this tank, so... The Hoplites. Make that. Our new tanks. Cancel that invasion plan. Unfortunately, those guys are, as I said, those guys are gone. But that's, that's just kind of the way it is sometimes. All right. Plan B. Plan B. Plan B is going to be... Let's try and come into Borneo here. Let's see if we can make that happen. Because if we could get the Borneo side, then the problem is, is that the South China Sea Is being a bit of a tough nut. Um, so let's see, you guys are not out there. It's my, um, My submarines that are out there. Uh, 
Because they are the ones with the range. Ah, we have civilian factories that aren't doing anything. That means we've finished building all of our stuff. Okay, then. Give me some more cruise missiles. Do I need more Sams? It does look like we need more Sams. All right. Give me some more. That'll keep those factories busy for a little while. Somewhere along the line. Oh, yeah, we must have bailed them out. Yeah, we did bail them out, didn't we? Will you take some stuff? No, apparently not. We need some better planes. Okay, well that's... All done, let's see, infrastructure. Working on improving our African infrastructure. See, because we got Pakistan, we actually have more range now. Um, Get all that built. Until I come up with anything else that we could do. Let's see, we have some 2025 ICBMs now. With thermobaric warheads. Ah, 
tactical strikes. Hmm. It's not selected like launch point and target point. From Greece to Greece, no. I'm not exactly sure how this works. What's a warhead? I'll have to figure out how this works at some point. I selected a launch point and target point. So how do I select a launch point and a target point? Hmm. MLRS 2005, we got tech uh, four. Let's steal some aviation industry blueprints. Actually, I probably have enough to run a second operation to steal some naval blueprints. Because I built silos. I built ballistic missile silos, have I not? They're still holding on there. Yeah, we're gonna grant the Vatican City the bailout. Well, they managed to push over. Unfortunately, they didn't get a port. If they managed to get a port, then I could reinforce them, but otherwise I'm kind of stuck. Yeah, 
but that's not gonna work. Trajectory selection. Like, how do I select a trajectory? No idea. No idea how that works. We're ready to attempt. Let's attempt a landing, but we are at the end of the episode, so we'll wait to see how that attempt goes. Yep, we lost our troops over there. Unfortunate. But so uh, we'll get those units replaced, and we'll try again. And maybe I'll try to figure out how this whole ballistic missile thing is supposed to work. Alright, but for now, we'll stop here. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment. And I will see you next time.